Listeners and podcast enjoyers to the fourth episode of the podcast, man. Also, what the fish is happening here, man? But yeah, welcome to the fourth episode. I did some, well, changes around here. Just visual ones, so only for those who will see the, the video version of this will well see the difference. Well, even though actually, I think this looks a bit better, right? But yeah, welcome to the podcast, man. The podcast. Uh, where the host, that is me, Roman, aka Yarman, will ramble about things that have happened, will happen, or that you just came up right now on the spot. And begin with the things that recently happened since the last episode, which didn't happen literally a few, nearly a week ago. That is actually something very special that got released on this day because well as a little teaser for the upcoming 2.0 stream or read view right now and also my birthday i have thought of a little teaser because well um Uh, brain? Working? What you want to say? Okay. Um, yeah. A little teaser. I released a teaser today of a little phone call that I had about two weeks ago. 
because well I wanted to record the I wanted to record the little segment I wanted to use for the 10th and final Sonic Frontiers video. However, I got an interesting call. That just said. And well, in the teaser, I just did a few snippets of that call. Just a few very important ones, like the way how to go back into my origin dimension. Or a yeah, I a way. Or that no. Oh. It's been years since that it started. Also, yes, this is part of my video log, just saying. Hmm. And yeah I will of course reveal the full little call that I had with this little fella this little twin tailed fella on my well 2.0 read view because oh boy that will be it's a reason why I call it a read view and not just a 2.0 stream which for those who have no idea what I mean what I talk right now is well one thing this has been bothering me is that I have been stuck with the same model since I started between back in 2021 so I've been stuck with the same model since well for over two years and well, the little call kinda give a good, a good insight on how I want it to be, finally. And uh, yeah, I contacted, contacted the original VTuber artist and rigger of my model. And well, well, it just fits, it just, it's it, it, the result is nice. Of course, I will not t tell you what it is because you can, you can speculate, or well, yeah, yeah, you can speculate on what the new outfit will, will be, or the changes that will happen. So, if you if you want to guess, just go to. Um, Twitter, vtubers.me, vmastodon, and just search up hashtag new Man. It's probably the silhouette of mine, and well, you can just guess well, how, it, how the end result will look. I give you a little hint. Or well, actually two hints. I like computers. And it's going to be golden. The outfit is really golden. Those are the only two hints. And yeah, it is. There will be some real changes, especially with the logo, because I want to redo the logo finally after all. Over two years. I mean, I'm free. I guess how oh I this TR logo, which yes, this is a combined T and an R, not a just regular R for well Armen. No, the little thing sticking out of on the left side of the R that is part of the T. And if you really look closely on, on the logo, it is you can still see that. It's really just a combined R and the T. Like you can, when when the, when the curve on the R happen starts on the top, you, you see that it's that, that, that's a few pixels off. That is actually because, well, 
the, the, the form that I use, Ario, this is not very good, I think. But um, yeah. So if you if you are kind of excited about everything, then just mark your calendars for August twenty third, twenty twenty three, six p.m. Central European Standard Time, which is. I have to really look this up now. My favorite site for this. Hmm. Hmm. Uh, I I really looked this up now, so um, hmm. so yeah, August twenty fourth, twenty twenty three, six p.m. Central European Standard Time, or nine a.m. Pacific Daylight Savings Time. Is it? Yeah, day Pacific Daylight Time, or Eastern or twelve a.m. Eastern. Daylight time or 11 a.m. Central Daylight time. Also, I think Eastern Daylight time is 12 p.m. Yeah. So, yeah, mark your calendars. That is the date where it starts of 2.0, 2.0 Roman, and I'm really excited. Oh, yeah. Something else happened the last few, the nearly week since the last episode. Kind of. I mean. I mean, the only thing that happened was a resolve. Um, ring? Well, yep, the we descent fundraiser that I've talked about well in the last episode yeah that 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 thing was amazing like really amazing and well the end result is um ninety thousand dollars for trans life lifeline and yo I still have it open the thing I think I also have the panel technically also active so if you want you can go to my twitch channel and go to the vdescent panel where the fundraiser is still running I think, yeah. however I I will definitely get rid of the rewards because well yeah, it, 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 it didn't it didn't go out. However, one funny thing though is that of my other personal thing, and that is well, mm, brain, 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 and that is that. It is really close to well I'm really close to 500 followers here on Twitch and you know what that means that means that Roman has to do the hot chip challenge soon like very soon oh boy I think I should already buy the, the chip just in case and mm, yeah that is that is that is scary so the moment where it says 500 i will definitely i will i have to buy the chip 
and then have to decide which stream I will eat the chip and what I will do with the rest of the stream. Maybe make a video or just make a video. Hmm. I don't know really right now. But yeah, it is. It is. It is close. And yeah, I am, I am scared, but also very happy. I'm scared happy. Hmm. So, did anything else happen? Um, I think not really. Hmm. Maybe some stuff that happened recently that I have saw but not really talked about it all. Hmm. I have literally really no idea what to say. The fact that I call this, um, and I call this podcast, uh, oh, no, yeah, right, 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 right. Um, one thing that I did, that did happen, actually, is that, Oh, brain, you really disappoint me right now. One thing that happened recently. Okay, now, really, brain, why, why, why is it so hard? Why is it so hard to think of the thing? I know I have, I had the thing, but I have completely forgotten it. Oh, oh, yeah, right now I see it. And that is that I have finally planned to invite the guests to the, well, to the podcast, man. And to be fair, I, the only thing that I have actually decided on this, on the, the only thing that I have decided for the for a future podcast main episode is actually the person. However, I haven't asked that person yet because I want to have the questions that I want to ask that person before I ask the person. Because, hey, maybe if there's a good time. Also, I think it's better to, well, record this instead of doing it life like the last three episodes four episodes <laughs> yeah the last hold up my brain <laughs> okay i have an error in the visuals thing here <laughs> um um it's actually three episodes however my brain me who was very but to be very fast for some reason for the for the for the image that i usually usually use for well my for the video version has completely forgotten the episode number because hey this is episode three however if you watch the video you see wait why is it saying episode four then and simply, Roman is an idiot. <laughs> I, will, I will try to correct this somehow. <laughs> Alright, act actually... Actually, I have a better idea how I do this real fast. Like, real fast. And... But it just takes me a little while because the thing that I use is, is taking a little... A little good while. So in the meantime, if you have something to, to drink, drink something, drink it, because hey, it's good for your health and your sanity, especially if it's water, because then it's definitely 
good for your health and your sanity. So. Only thing I need now is to basically change one thing. So getting rid of you and you. So. And the only thing I need now is basically just change this one. So, now the only question is also... No, I have no idea. I have a really good idea. Stop oh, finish. I have done the thing. The thing is, hopefully it doesn't... Did it change? Nope, it doesn't change, so I will change it real quick. Hold on, hold on. Port. Oh, I exported it into the wrong thing. Ah, okay. That is why. Yes, I would like to replace it. Thank you. Hopefully it did. Uh, yes, it did. Okay, so now it's, it's actually saying episode 3 instead of episode 4. Now my OCD question mark is now okay, we can... I don't know, I'm now happy of this. I mean, I could have kept this, but nah. Just nah. Especially if episode 4 will maybe include the, 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 the person that I talked about right before that. Maybe, maybe not, I don't know. I can see into the future. I am a, a human with godlike powers from another dimension, but none of those godlike powers can let me see to the future. I could jump to the future. However, I would still be in place. Yeah. <clears throat> anyway. Anything else that I could talk about? My brain is saying no. 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 Hmm. Anything interesting at work happening, Roman? Well, um, no, Roman. Sadly, no. We got some new monitors that we ordered. We got the laptop for an a colleague that wanted to have a private laptop to reduce the stress in the IT department because um, that, uh, um, that person always goes to me for installing updates which funny thing that happened very okay a few a few weeks ago which I also posted on Mastodon and also probably talked about this also on Alexa um this colleague came to come, came to me, said, "Hey, Roman, the thing that you always update needs an update again." Okay, let me check. Okay, up to run update. Yeah, sorry, but def, but we need a specific file for you. Oh no, where is the file located? Uh, yeah, we don't know. What? Yeah, we don't know. We don't know, but they but. If you have the file, then you didn't, you didn't, you didn't give it to us. I don't know where the file is. But sorry! I just tried to get rid of this. But ha 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 ha! It's a special software. And even on the internet it says, yeah, no. And even the recommended troubleshooting that I also found. Yeah, no. Didn't work too. And this took a while. A good while. A good, good while. A good, good, good will store. 
maybe in your near cl close to you. Just maybe. I don't know why. I don't know where you live. Or where anybody you <clears throat> But yeah. I, I, after some very try and trial and error, mostly error, I said, yeah, you know what, I can't, I can't. And he said, you, you know what, it doesn't matter anymore. I, I still get my new PC soon, so you, you, you do your own stuff. Because, yes, the reason to why he got him, why he ordered a private laptop by the same reseller we use is to so I basically don't have to update this specific software for him and yeah let me tell you this is kind of a nice and also not so nice not so nice thing because the not so nice thing is well now one thing that I kind of like to do because I can do this thing now I can't do it anymore. Now I have to wait till somebody needs some help. And this is mostly just nothing. Because even today, only two people needed help. One who met my fellow IT colleague and also IT admin. Because we only two IT people in the whole company. Our company is not that, that, that big, by the way. Um, he gave me the, this colleague because... Um, he tried to reset the Microsoft Office mode two-factor authentication. Uh, yeah. No, wrong, wrong. I have to say this completely wrong. I asked him, what is the problem? He said, yeah, this colleague needs help at this specific software with the multi-factor authentication. However, I always reset, disable and enable it in the office. But it doesn't work. So could you look for it, into it? And right away I just went, so you want to look at the multi-factor authenticator for a program that is not connected to office where we also have multi-factor authentication activated. Which you have actually been resetting. But this is not a thing that needs to be reset because actually it's actually this one program. <laughs> and when I, when I told him this, in a way, not really directly like that, but in a way, he immediately just go... <sighs> and yeah. Did we fix it though? No. That I know. And oh yeah, the other thing that actually that the other thing happened yesterday. <laughs> that that's how much IT stuff we actually do in our company. Because the most of the time I just watch videos on YouTube. And play solely there. Mostly bo both at the same time. But yeah, the other person had a little problem with their VPN. I just re-imported the connections and it worked. Yes. In the beginning of this one, the same colleague also had his, the same problem with their VPN. And according to the troubleshooting guide, it could be because of the connection being a little bit recognized as unknown device. Which, actually, no, it, it was recognized, but somehow it wanted to fix itself, but it didn't work. Which, reinstalling the program fixed it. But, of course, then, well, yesterday, happened again. And that this time the fix was reimporting all the connections, because then they... The adapter that is used to fight the program, by the VPN program, just goes, hmm, now I need some fixing. It's fixed. <sighs> uh, 
And hmm. I don't know what to say because well this is everything that could have and oh hmm, ha. what could I say to for more um hmm hmm I don't know Hmm, I have really no idea what to say now. Like, really, I am now again at a loss. But not loss, if you remember that I mean. with the videos that happen well um actually actually i have exported the two videos that i edited during the fundraiser on saturday like vtuber connect part eight which ends on a very interesting note just want to say you have this or that the radio console fail in the year and hello charlotte part 10 which is also the end of hello charlotte Episode two. Yes, then we have some uh, some. Uh, then, then the playthrough series is get a, gets a little bit wonky because of just an image created by the developer of the Hello Charlotte series. But why do you want to say Shirish? Hello Charlotte Shirish. Um. Because, well, the developer, Eva Rain, replayed all their games and made a little graphic with all their notes. And it is, for me, technically a little timeline thing, like which game comes before which, ga which other game. And... Uh, I need to look it up. Because I know that this notes thing actually is very interesting. Oh, wait. Hmm. We have Friday with Henry Huxley. Okay, this is still in development. Okay, good to know. Um, brain working? Brain currently of the. Uh, you know, when, when your brain is going to uh. It is going to uh. I currently literally to uh. Ah. I have found the gallery. I have found the gallery. I need the gallery. Because the gallery is actually the thing that I actually want to do most. Give me, give me gallery. Give me the gallery. Because the gallery has the things that I really need. There's no gallery. You lied to me. Unless it's in the other one, because <laughs> did you know that there are actually two different galleries every years of this game? One for well, just Hello Charlotte, and one for the developer and uh, yeah, yeah, I think this is where it actually is Hopefully.
Uh, but, but no, this is not the thing. Uh, sorry, son of a heads. Oh, there's the thing. Ah! There we have it. So. So. The notes from Hello Charlotte by Ethering, the developer. First, begin with episode one. And we go with episode two. Then we come. What? I'm in scale. Hold up! Hold up! Okay, okay, Heaven's Gate comes... Okay, I put Heaven's Gate later. Because... Boy! The only thing that I hate in Heaven's Gate is... Is basically... Oh, you want some... You want some sound. You want some music. You want some nice sound effects. You get those. But only if you're deaf. And sorry, that was a joke. Because, yeah, you hear nothing. It's just complete silence. Like, nothing. During that whole stream, part of the stream, I just talked, basically. I just read aloud. Aloud. I made jokes. And at the beginning, when I noticed this, I instantly said, Hey, Roman, who's going to edit this? Please put in some, some music. And hop on. But yeah, I put Heaven's Gate because of this later, later into the playthrough series. Because now we begin with Delirium, which is um, <clears throat> it is, <laughs> it is something. <laughs> it is something. <laughs> So what does it say about episode 3 when has started and everyone in BGM screamed I really felt it what happened again I completely forgot what happened in that part of the game um, also also Pesco Anri no joke except in episode 2 yes Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, maybe maybe episode three and is a bit is a bit a bit, ah. but um yeah the most emotional choice is in this episode. Hmm. Okay, interesting stuff about episode two. But yeah, I I'm actually really interested also about uh, the other stuff that Ifori made because hey, Hello Charlotte was actually really nice. It was complicated at one point. My brain just was literally melting on logic, and but the art style is is actually the mm, good plus point because. While the sprites themselves in the game are pixelated, like literally just the pic just pixels, like 8 bit, the all the images like like CGs or or character faces, those are noise, like mwah. nice. But by looking from even in delirium or even in rain, even in the pictures are just nice. It is kind of a different thing between oh, well, it is. Hmm, how can I describe it? It is just you can literally see the it is that each image has been made 
literally with him. And this is just noise. I'm not scared because I just came across a picture of 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 Charlotte with hollowed out, hollowed, hollow, hollowed eyes, hollowed eyes, hollowed eyes, eyes. I don't know how to say this in a good way, but um, yeah, she has no eyes. There's no blood. There's just you see, Char Charlotte, Charlotte Bullshire. She just stares into your soul. Well, she actually has no eyes. You know, she ju just stares you into the soul. But yeah, it, it is it is actually really nice. All the images and so on. And yeah. I definitely want to play the other games. And... Um, Yeah, that is all I'm gonna say. The only thing is, starting with episode one, you immediately know that something's not right. Because, hey, you're in a white world, completely white. Suddenly you go into a PC and then suddenly you're in an RPG Maker Castle Mansion. I don't know, number 3560. And then and, and you just go, okay, why? And, and then after everything happened, you have the, the, the same color scheme as before, with the with the whites, with the with the minimalistic view. And then there was the end. Then there was the end. And I said only in the highlight video of when this happened. I even added a little thing with Hello Sh Roman being Hello Charlotte confused because, oh boy, this is not the this is that is not the most weirdest thing ever. I saw me while if you have watched me playing episode two or even watched the editing part of the fundraiser last Saturday, I came across now the fun room. You know the fun room. A fun room with all the house tenants just suddenly appearing there and everybody just greeting each other. And then suddenly, if you greet it, uh, say hello to one of them, they suddenly appeared again. And again. And again. And again. And again. <sighs> well, the whole time the same I, I, YouTube funny, funny moment Kevin McLeod song plays. I have no idea how what the name of that song is. I know it is, it is used by it is used by many YouTubers. It, I, I, I googled it now. Oh well I, I search YouTube for the name. <clears throat> Kevin McLeod McLeod, I don't know how to how about this name. Funny music. I'm just this. No, this is not the wrong song. That is not the song. That is definitely Pixel Pika Polka. This is the song. <laughs> Uh, oh, uh, just just in case, I need to cross check this. Hello, Charlotte, part ten. Yes, it's Pixel Peaker Polka. My God, the song is according to this seven years old. My God. It's also funny. I, I just took down in the comments and see someone is saying, Christ, Kevin just made 
every song for every early YouTube video then here. <laughs> Am I exactly in the hell of Charlotte too? But yeah. Episode 2. Fun room. One, once in the fun room, you can't escape the fun room. Unless you wake up there, then you can escape the fun room. It just also doesn't make sense in my opinion because you su Charlotte suddenly wakes up and is in the fun room. And then, and then after everything goes black, she is suddenly in front of well, something that I will not spoil if you haven't played the games yet. And, uh, yeah. What, be what happened between you going dark in the fun room and then suddenly appearing the in this place? Also, I call it the fun room because just of the song. I mean, there's also the smile room. But you don't want to be the smile room. You definitely don't want to be in the smile room. Because it says smile room, but it is not making you smile. I mean, okay, it, it could technically make you smile. However, you you probably have no power. Like just completely just lying there and just looking happy with the top. And yeah, I know it, it, it sounds a little bit frightening, but it is that that is the power of Hell Charlotte, episode two. And then this episode three. Oh god, episode three. If you're fond of Charlotte, this is, okay. Little, little little something here. If you think of of Charlotte Bullshire being this thing during the first two episodes then episode 3 will basically crush you with this thought and even kicks you down with that no actually it kicks you and then it crushes you because then well mm. <clears throat> oh boy I just remembered uh, Roman probably made a lot of references to to, to the other episodes the, during his playthrough of, of the Lyrum. Oh boy, I have to censor a lot. Because jokes about episode 2 and episode 1, understandable. Everything ab about episode 3, no. Because, well, how can you crack jokes about something that hasn't, has, hasn't happened yet? I mean, it has happened. I have played it already, but but it's the video pre playthrough series. It didn't happen yet. Also, I need to cut out a lot of stuff because I have died a lot in this in this game in Delirium, which is also funny. The game is only about thirty minutes long, and it's also just Ether Rain just testing a, a few things in RPG Maker. Which is also why it is not technically canon, but I, but, but, but I still, I still, I, I don't, I don't, it is not canon. But because of this long thing, I, 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 I put it in there between episode two and episode three. And not like I said in doing at the beginning of the scene, episode one and episode two. <laughs> oh boy. That's going to be the heart. I just remember I wanted to do something this 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 Saturday. I have completely forgotten what I wanted to do this Saturday. And I mean like to do with well streaming. Like ah no. Hmm. Do I actually also have anything else to talk about, maybe? Um well, technically, I don't think so. Like, yeah, it's, there's nothing. Oh my god.
Okay, okay, brain. Or well, um, marketing people from Sega. I'll just put in you do, play play Sonic Forces and you get get this Lego Sonic character. Don't put this in there because I thought I have the trick to play Sonic for Forces. I don't want to play Sonic Forces. Get to get Lego Sonic. But no, they actually talk about Sonic Forces on iOS. Wow. <clears throat> anyway. This is just a little something here. Oh yeah, actually, talking about Sonic. I am kind of hyped, hyped about, well, the upcoming Sonic game. With, well, it being... It being actually int very interesting. Like, hmm. It, it is a, it's a 2D classic Sonic game, but it is a, it is a, it is a 2.5D classic Sonic game. And um, yeah. It is. Mm. It is that. Um. Yeah. I. 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 The, the, I just say in German egg, 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 egg. It's also funny. I. I say, I. Like. First person, me, I. But at the same time, the letter I also sounds like you'd say in German egg. Which little German fun fact here. Oh, well, Austrian fun fact that I have said a few, a few too many times. But did you know that in the past before pineapples got imported to Austria, strawberries were called pineapple. Like the German word for pineapple is well, the now used German name for pineapple, ananas, is used to call strawberries before pineapples were imported. So, if you learn German and you want to order, I don't know, pizza with pineapple, then don't be surprised if for unknown reasons, you see strawberries on your pizza. And to anybody who's going to say, oh, hey, what about the pi normal pineapple? Go out. Everybody has their own prefer prefer preferences. Okay? Okay. <clears throat> anyway. And also, I have said this also many times. My, my favorite pizza topping is ham and corn. Fight me. <coughs> Sorry. <laughs> yeah. I think at this point it is a good thing to end this now, okay? So. Yeah, this is now the end of the Podcast Man episode 4 with your host, Roman aka The Armin. Don't forget, August 21st, 2023. 6 p.m. Central European Time, 9 a.m. Pacific Daylight Time, 12 p.m. Central Daylight Time, and 11 a.m. Eastern Daylight Time, for, well, the reveal of Armin to Bono. And also be a little bit excited about Podcast Min episode 4, probably. With, with the guest. Of course, this is just a speculation because I, again, I need to do stuff. I have to figure out the questions and ask the person. Because if I do not, then neither of that, then this doesn't make sense. <coughs> and, um, yeah, this is the end. I hope you enjoyed 
probably uh, maybe i don't know this talk rambling mostly rambling it's only rambling it's just or even tension i don't know the difference of these words of me and i wish you all a wonderful morning evening night whenever you listen to this and have a wonderful whatever your day holds or well tomorrow if you watch if you listen to this at night here there are men Thank you.